exploded and died. No, I, I, I completely understand that. We will. We This is called Persian Pickles. It's my art prize entry for 2014. It's taking the, the paisley patterns and creating a whole alphabet. Uh, Persian Pickles kind of sounds like a made up funny name, but it's actually a historical play on words with um, some of the American traditionalists that started to poke fun at paisley patterns and uh, how they, they come from Persia and they kind of look like a pickle with that little swoop that comes up where it used to hang from the vine. The reason why I chose to do alphabet, and I'm going to be doing all the numbers as well, is because I want to show that letters are art. They are design and they have a flow and pattern and balance and contrast. And we may use them every day, we may not look at them as being pieces of artwork, but they're functional art. And that's really what I enjoy, is something that can be used, not just put up on a pedestal and, and sat there to collect dust or you have to stay away from. This is something that, it's beautiful. It's functional, it draws your eye, it tells a story, it moves you through the piece, and each one is completely unique. Every time you look at one, it tells a different story, and it just flows through. Some of them, like the M, have a really traditional and a symmetrical feel to them. Then you have other ones that are slightly more abstract in nature, like the H. It's just all about the, the flow and, and the interaction of the shapes within each other and, and how, it, how it works. My whole goal for this art prize is to have people look at, at fonts and look at the alphabet as something that was designed. It's not a painting, it's not a 3D piece, it's something that's used every day. And the whole paisley pattern itself is beautiful and that, that's why I chose it to represent some of the anatomy with the typography.